Hi, in this video, I explain how to set up a social proof box. This is a box that you can integrate via HTML on your pages. It tells page visitors who last bought your product using real but completely anonymized customer data. This strengthens your customer's trust in you, as they can be sure that there are other customers and that it's not some sort of scam. For you, this means more buyers and increased sales. Please note that we have another similar feature called the social proof bubble. This isn't a fixed box on your page, but rather a pop-up that alternates different customer data in the sidebar. If you'd like to create one, you should watch the video that's now linked in the top right-hand corner. All you need before that is a product in Digistore24, and of course, to know where you want to embed the box, whether on your sales page, opt-in page, or even directly on the order form itself. No matter where you want to put it, you need to have already created this page or environment. But now let's get started. First of all, go to Account, and then Conversion Tools. Once the page is loaded, switch to the Social Proof Widget tab. Then click on this button here, and make sure you select Box before clicking on OK. Now you can set up your box. Firstly, you have to enter a name for it. This is a name only for you, so that you don't lose the overview. Your customers won't see this name. Then make sure that you set active to yes, and then select the products whose customers should be displayed in this box. Here you change the size of your box. I'd advise that you don't change anything for the time being, but rather place the box in the desired position as soon as it's ready, and then adjust the dimensions here if necessary. Be careful though, because anytime you change something, you have to include the code again, which we'll copy later. Now set how many columns the box should consist of and adjust the corresponding text in the box in this field. At this point, note that you can also include placeholders which are here below. They will then automatically be adjusted by the respective data applicable to the customer. For example, date will be replaced by the date of the corresponding purchase. Finally, you just have to select how the country should be displayed. If you want the full country name to be shown, select yes. If the country code is sufficient, select no. Now we come to the box's design. Simply set the different colors as you like them. I'll show you the box once more. Because it's a little small, this is what's meant by the country color. And this is the frame. And lastly, if you want to add your own CSS code here, click on yes and paste it in this field here. Once you're done, Click on Save at the bottom. Now you'll see the HTML code for integrating your social proof box. You just have to integrate this code where you want to position this box. The most popular use case for this is probably the sales page. And since I built my page with CoChannel, I can easily do this in the page builder by including the HTML JS component and then pasting the code into it. If you use a service other than CoChannel, or even a web designer, just ask them if you get stuck here. If you now load the page in the preview, the last people to buy your product are displayed. So congratulations! If you'd like to discover more about other ways to optimize your sales process, just take a look at the playlist that's now displayed.